Mr. Trump, are you looking forward to testifying today? I am. So while uh, Israel is being attacked, while Ukraine is being attacked, while inflation is eating our country alive, I'm down here, and these are all political opponents, attack ads by the Biden administration. Their poll numbers are terrible. You saw what happened today to the New York Times and CBS came out with a poll that we leave all over the place, but uh, it's a very unfair situation. Election interference, it's all it is. It's kind of ridiculous. The numbers are much greater than on the financial statement. Uh, we've already proven that. They said Mar a Lago is worth You have a racist attorney general who made some terrible statements. I mean, you see some more that came over the wires today. Uh, it's a very sad situation for our country. We shouldn't have this. This is for third world countries. And you know, very unfair. It's very unfair. But in the meantime, the people of the country understand it, they see it, and they don't like it. They don't like it, because it's uh, political warfare, as you would call it, or political lawfare. Another name, that got a lot of names for it. But usually it takes place in third world countries and banana republics. Uh, nobody's ever seen that. To this extent, we've never seen it here. Uh, but we will go along, and we will hopefully uh, do very well in every regard. We'll win the election, and we'll Make America great again. That's what we're going to do. We're going to make America great again. But we have to take away from the thugs that we deal with and the horrible people that actually must hate our country to do this. But we will uh, we'll fight very hard for our country. Thank you very much, everybody. We are on the brink of World War III. Open borders, high inflation, crime-ridden cities, no, we got to stop Trump. With them doing that and ignoring the downfall of the United States, that's how we know that they hate the United States.